Everyone's looking for a bargain these days, even when it comes to cosmetic procedures. People are cutting back on treatments like liposuction, brow lifts, and Botox. And now there's a cheaper way to get rid of wrinkles that won't cut so deep. Maureen tells us more in a special medical moment. Okay, so this is a really easy procedure. Um, you're going to have probably around maybe five little small injections. I use a, a tiny needle, um, and I just treat the small areas. 59-year-old Laura Pletcher of Bristol has never had any injections, but she's decided to give Dysport a try. Well, cost is one thing, and I'm not getting any younger, so I might as well try it. Dr. Ronald Downs from the Center PC says Dysport is a lot like Botox. Well, Dysport is botulism toxin. It's botulism toxin A, just like Botox. It's, it's manufactured in a very similar way. Uh, and it's a protein. It's manufactured from uh, the botulism bacteria, and it's designed to paralyze muscles. Are there side effects? Absolutely no fear involved. This is a heat-killed bacteria, which means the bacteria doesn't ex it's not alive. So Laura decided to take care of one area that's been bothering her. Well, I'm concerned about the frown lines between my eyes. I have sensitivity to the light, and I think that over time has increased the frown lines. Since Laura's on her lunch break, Karen gets started. Okay, so I'm going to start here. And you might feel a small pinch. Traditionally, that's all you should feel. Doing okay? Yes. Dysport has been used in Europe for years and was FDA approved in April for use in the U.S. And Dr. Down says people aren't asking for it just because it's new. Uh, they love a couple different things. One, it does have a faster onset, and two, it's a little cheaper. He says he uses both Botox and Dysport, but the new product is a win-win for patients. But I think long term, now you've got two, uh, you've got two of these products on the market, and hopefully that business competition will help drive the cost down a little bit. Which is helpful for everyone. I think so. But the proof, as they say, is in the pudding. So here's a look at Laura's furrowed brow area before, and this picture was taken just a week later. As you can see, that frown line she was concerned about is gone like father time. And Karen says the best part? Well, we're trying to treat that line or that wrinkle, but we're not trying to change their overall natural appearance. No, not bad at all. So how much cheaper is Dysport than Botox? Because of the way it's made, you need more Dysport than Botox, but it still averages out to a savings of about $50 to $75 per visit, which is every three to four months. And for more information on Dysport, you can call the Center PC. We have a link on our website at WNU.com. Just click on Maureen's Medical Moment.